everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're coming across an issue where this item was encoded in a format that's not supported, error code 0xc00d5212. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So there's going to be a few different commands we're going to run here. So hopefully it should be able to resolve your problem. And we're going to go and jump right into it. And the first thing we're going to do is open up the start menu, type in CMD, best result, check it back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. Now into this elevated command line window, you want to type in SFC followed by space forward slash scan now. So again, SFC space forward slash scan now. Once you have it as it appears on my screen, go ahead and hit enter on your keyboard to run it. We'll take a couple minutes to run, so please be patient.
Okay, so once that's done, I'm going to have a few more commands in the description of the video. I want you guys to copy each one one at a time. This one's going to be an SFC scan file command, so just copy that. Uh, right click and copy from the description of my video that next command. Go up to the top bar of the command prompt window here, right click on it, select edit, and then select paste to paste it in. And then we're going to do the next command. There's going to be a couple more here. We're going to do each one one at a time. And then we're going to do an association command. We're going to paste that one in. Give it a second. And then finally a check disk command. We're going to paste in here. Hit enter. Okay, so once that's done, you should be able to close out of here. What's we'll it just restart your computer? And then hopefully that should honestly be about it. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. Do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.